All right. What's up? Nothing. So I I, I finished and I binged um the Tiger King. So you drank the Kool Aid. I drank it. I, I said I wasn't gonna watch this thing. People had been talking about. It. I was like, oh, that's so stupid. I could be doing something else, which I could have been, but this is well worth it during the curve. It was. <laughs> now, see, I wasn't going to give up after the first episode because I was like, I was confused. I didn't know what I was watching because I didn't get a whole lot of information about what it was about right. before my friend told me to watch it. So yeah. I'm like, this this don't make no sense. I can't, <laughs> I can't watch this. And he was like, no, just stick with it. Trust me, it gets better. So I, I, I fought my way through and then I was just like, oh my gosh, what am I watching? What did I, what did I put into my eyes right now? <laughs> it was a hot mess. You can't stop. Listen, you cannot, I, I tell people, do not watch this if you headed to bed. You will not be able to turn this off. Like, right. it was... <laughs> It's like watching uh, a train wreck. It's like you want to look away, but you can't. You just yeah. gotta, you gotta be able to tell the story. And it's like you can't make this stuff up. So like, so let's let's give our our impressions of the show. So five words to describe your impression aftermath <laughs> of watching the Tiger King. Okay, I would say. Personality personality disorders. That's the first thing. Both um, of them, right? Both of them. Everybody. Both of them. <laughs> um, uh, jail time. Um, the first thing that came to my mind was just crazy. Country. Um... I don't want to ever meet people like this. That's not like, <laughs> that's not a word, but that's an impression. Um, I think that was five, but yeah, it was in insane and addictive. Okay. I, I, I definitely would say crazy. A mess. <laughs> At the same time, I got inspiration out of this. <laughs> and um disbelief for sure and shock <laughs> because every episode was more shocking than that the it next if you thought you had seen it all you see something else but you know where the inspiration part comes in for me which is wild i was like i didn't even know any of this was a career option for, for me like you can really have the life goal of being like a a, far, a zoo owner that trains tigers all day or like you could people live like that like that's a lifestyle like in none of my college books did i see the option for like you could just live on a a, a tiger preserve all day or, or just kind of know somebody with this though like well, it's like these people came from the bottom they came from nothing and they <laughs> and they were living their dream like that's what i got out of it was like you really can do whatever you want to do in life. You don't have to follow this path of go That's to college true. and become a doctor or a lawyer. Like this, I have an really, idea. this can really be, and, and not just, I would never want to do that, but like, it just opened my eyes up to like, this is how some people live and it's a it's an option. Right. For you. So right. that's where I get inspiration from the show. Like, you know, I, I, I don't even think that people like this live that next door to me, you know, <laughs> but they do. <laughs> it made me a little nervous because I'm like, somebody could get tired of their tiger one day and just be like, I'm done. Just Bye. let it lose. Just let it lose. Act like it ran away from home. <laughs> and then they were like, oh, you could buy a baby tiger for $2,000. I'm like, that's pretty cheap. I mean, how much do pit bulls cost? People buy. I know people, people say people like that, or like those little mini um, like them little terriers. Man, you could spend a few grand on those. I could get a whole real tiger out here. To a the whole tiger. Yeah. I was like, that's the price of a good vacation, you know, <laughs> you know. So it's like it was educational. That's another word. <laughs> educational. 
it was very well, hey, man, this 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 quarantine got us watching stuff that's just like ludicrous that we wouldn't ever have time for watching no but i i mean it we got a lot of entertainment out of it I it came out at the perfect time and like spoiler alert so if you have not seen it then don't listen to this part but i was not i i don't know how i felt about the fact that he went to jail like, like you didn't want him to go to jail <laughs> up and down i'm like i know we all rooting for this guy like dang man why they do him like that yeah like really i'm like did he really you know, do it though did it's just his own him? fault because i looked at it like i kind of felt that way too like man just let him out but like <laughs> but i thought about it and i was like that he was obsessed with this lady he should have let it go he was doing he he got obsessed with carol baskin and wanting to attack this lady, he should have let it go. And he went way too far in this position. Like all the stuff he kept doing and making all these videos about her, it was like, okay, let it go. Like this is gonna yeah. lead to ruin. Oh, oh. You got, you got, you already lost a lawsuit by and all this. Like just move on with your life. But he couldn't let it go, and that's what that's what ended him up where he is. I think if he had just been able to let it go. <laughs> gotta let it go yeah so but man yeah so let's that that's really all we came to talk about right <laughs> yeah. and, and just and, and we want and we want to see what else this quarantine what other ge gems and jewels it will bring us yes name it i think talking about um i with all this time on our hands, I think also like I definitely been listening to old school music, music, so I think that'll be a good one to talk about too. Just the whole thing about music. Yeah, we gonna have some. We gotta have some quarantine playlists. Yeah, I yeah. mean it's been bringing us a lot of good music too, man. I've been seeing all kind of um, Instagram concerts and yeah. battles and stuff like so much entertainment. Out yeah, here. all these artists and musicians doing their little living room concerts. So. Yeah. It's, it's I'm like, oh, somebody, somebody else needs to play something for me. Somebody's saying something. Let me in, be entertain me. Like I'm watching Instagram lives more and everything. But yeah. I, I would not mind. Like I watched this whole thing and I was a little sad that it was over. I was also kind of glad that it was over because <laughs> it was just <laughs> sucking away my life. But I, I wouldn't mind seeing little uh, people's like you know, after posts, like the gifts and stuff they make, because they're hilarious. With the Carol, the Carol Baskin, like, you oh, know. Oh, yeah, they got some funny ones, man. I've seen some videos that were real funny. The <laughs> and parodies. And, yeah. and they got a new episode coming out now. I okay. saw, like, that they actually added a bonus episode that's oh. coming tomorrow, the 12th, April 12th, <laughs> so that we could get a little bit more uh, Tiger King fix. There's a new episode gonna come out. <laughs> Listen, y'all, if you if you are planning to watch this stuff with someone, make sure it's somebody that's gonna go ahead and watch it because I had to just leave my husband in the dust because he kept saying that like, okay, we'll watch it. Oh, wait on me, and I like I was like I can't wait, I cannot wait. I'm watching this. You can yeah. go. Yeah, I'm gonna watch this. <laughs> yeah, I definitely had I definitely had to turn a few people on to this to this show so. Um, yeah, I couldn't just be watching it alone and say, you know, only I saw it. I, I think I told my dad to watch it. Yeah. I got I got a couple of my friends to watch it. I'm like, you gotta watch this show. <laughs> what so what's your your rating? So from a from a zero to five, with five being like the best thing you've ever seen in your life. Uh or I would say the most addicting thing. Those might be two uh, different I say I give it about a three. Yeah. I mean, I, I could have not watched it, I think, but it was, it was entertaining for sure, but I've seen better things. So okay. I'm pretty hard on shows in general. So I'm gonna give it a three. I, I'll give it a 3.5. Okay. All right. Because yeah. it's cool. not necessary, but it's, it is quite entertaining. Definitely. Know? Yeah. It, I, I, it wasn't must see TV, but. Yeah. I give it a COVID-19 thumbs up though. Like. All right. Right. True. Now. <laughs> True. <laughs> All right. Well, we're gonna have to come back with the with another review of another show that we gotta watch. Did you finish on my block? No, I'm gonna finish, that. finish that. Now okay. that's another one we should talk about. We'll talk about that one. Yeah, that's a good show. All, All right. right. Okay. Cool.
Yay. So we're going to keep coming with more COVID-19 slash quarantine chronicles because you know what? We have nothing but time on our hands to do that. So a little bit different from our I Get Better podcast, but we're going to we're gonna use our internet time wisely. Yeah. So, yeah. all right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So talk to you later. Bye. Bye.